annual Consumer Electronics Show in Las Vegas. A week-long event is underway right now. It's the show place for the latest in high-tech gear. This is where industry insiders get their first look at the coolest and smartest products of the future. And this year, one of the big themes of the show involves the latest trend in high-definition television. It's called 4K technology, and it is capable of showing video at a resolution four times higher than standard HD. Really cool for consumers, not really cool for people on television for a living. Uh, the big question is, what can you watch on it, though? Joining me now from Vegas, Peter Kafka, senior editor at Recode. NBC News Group is a minority stakeholder in Recode. We've also got a content sharing partnership with Recode. Uh, Pete, it feels like we've we've been down this road before with 3D televisions, which never really right. quite took off. What do you what do you think of 4K? I, I think 4K is real, and it, it will be some version of a reality in the next few years. These sets are getting much cheaper. Uh, a year ago, these things were tens of thousands of dollars. Now they're thousands of dollars. You can even get a very small 4K monitor for 700 bucks right now. Um, so I think over time, the, the cost will come down enough that people will sort of buy them whether or not there's stuff to watch on them. It's not like watching a 3D set where you had to stick on glasses and embarrass yourself and convince your wife or your kids that this was a good thing to do. It'll, you'll just have a nice picture. Uh, again, the real issue is what you'll be able to watch on those sets. What will you be able to watch on those sets? And, and how clearer of a picture right, are we right. talking about here? Well, I'm the wrong guy to ask about the clarity of the picture because I bought my first TV set ever last year, which I think is pretty good. It's a plasma. Uh, but the, the, they look great. Uh, the reality is there's not a lot to watch on them right now. Uh, Netflix literally has a handful of shows. Uh, the next season of uh, House of Cards will be in 4K. Uh, they're going to show old seasons of Breaking Bad in 4K. They bought some nature documentaries just to sort of show how great the stuff looks. It's sort of conceptual and branding right now. Um, but as these sets show up in people's homes, I think the TV folks, um, and especially folks who deliver web video, are going to start making this stuff available in 4K. So it's still probably two or three years out before it's really mainstream. Hey, hey really quickly while I have you here, we've been told for years now that, uh, yeah. that web TV is coming to our homes. Why has that not happened in mass yet? It doesn't happen right now because the way that the TV industry works right now makes a lot of money for the guys who sell uh, cable TV packages okay. like Comcast, which owns NBC Universal, and, and for the networks themselves. Uh, so it's very hard to sort of take the program people want to watch and break it up into smaller chunks and deliver it over the web. That said, people are going to try that again this year. Sony says they're going to do it this year. Peter Kafka from CES in Vegas. Peter, thank you.